Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Divya and I make videos related to lifestyle, comedy and dentistry. So please do consider subscribing to my channel and press the bell notification to stay notified with the videos I post. So today's video is about how you can find your question papers. Previous year question papers online or on Rajiv Gandhi University website. And also I'm going to suggest few companions or question banks that you can buy. So uh, if you didn't know, then I made a video previously on how to study for dental exams and I received a lot of DMs and comments asking where you could access these question papers or where you can buy these books from. So I thought why not make this video because at this point of uncertainty, not knowing where we're headed to, so I thought this was going to be a very helpful video for you guys. So here I am. So what I've done is on my website that is www.dvyagiridharan.com I have segregated the subjects based on the year of dental school and I've placed all the links to those books there. So please do have a look, links in the description box, all details are there. So um, I would like to say that ki there are few links that are affiliate links but otherwise all these books have been referred by me uh, during my years of dental course so it's a personal recommendation for you guys. So without any further ado, let's get into the Open up your browser and type either RGOHS or Rajiv Gandhi University. Scroll down and choose the option Downloads. From Downloads, you can press Collections under which you have to select Previous Year Question Paper option. Again, you have to press the previous year question paper option and then choose the subject. Subject is the curriculum that, I mean, course that you belong to. So here we press BDS and here the different years come up. So whichever year question paper you're looking for, press that particular year and all the question paper from first year to fourth year will be present here. So whichever year of dental school you belong to, you can choose from that. So the first book we have is by Singhi Yatiraj and it's one of my favorite books of all time. So here we first have chapter wise question papers, I mean questions, which is divided according to the chapter and into long essays, short essays and uh, short answers. You can see that the page number, that is the uh, page number for the answer for that particular question along with the year which it has been asked in has been mentioned. Why I love this book so much is because everything is mentioned point wise and at the same time a lot of nice simple diagrams have been given alongside good amount of tabular forms. So that is the reason I really really like this book and I would totally recommend it for the first years. So the next book we have here is again by Singhi Yatiraj for Physiology and Biochemistry and again this book has been such a saviour for me because I personally, you know, biochemistry is very difficult for me and because we have one paper for the two subjects, that is the marks are equally distributed between the two subjects, this book really saved me. Uh, again the pattern is the same, that is the questions are divided chapter wise with the answer page, I mean the page of the answers written next to it. Uh, physiology is something that is read better with flowcharts and you know diagrams and biochemistry is better written I mean better read with a lot of value the right values and uh, tabular form and this book provides exactly that and I would highly recommend if you're going for any book go for this book so the book we have for dental anatomy and histology is by this author called Ponala Rakesh I wouldn't say this is the best book out there and you know this this book can save you no a because um, there will be a a lot of mistakes um, in this book and at the same time it's clumsy like it's solved question paper wise so if you're looking for a particular question it's difficult to find in this book but you can keep this book for reference there are few questions that I read from this book but I would highly suggest and recommend that you read from Auburn's or any standard textbook but keep this book for reference to know what type of questions are asked now coming on to the most famous book among dental students, there will be no dental student who will not know the name of this book regardless of whether they know the name of their standard textbooks. But uh, yeah, I would just say that keep this book in hand for reference purpose only. Do not solely study the content from this book because there are a lot of mistakes. The pattern is the same, that is it is chapter wise divided into long essays, short essays and short answers. The thing I like about this book is at the behind you have previous year question bank. 
so previous year questions are mentioned according to which university it is that is you have uh, questions from rgohs which you can see i have marked in this uh, book so i only refer this uh, for these questions and sometimes for like few answers which i can't find now coming on to second year subjects the first book is a question bank and that is the dento gist from here on i will be emphasizing more on referring question banks because uh, studying from standard textbooks is a must and trust me it's one of the biggest mistakes that i did so um i highly recommend you have question banks in hand here you can see that it has been divided chapter wise again into 5 uh, 10 5 and 2 markers and um whichever question that you're looking for i mean the answer the page numbers mentioned alongside the question behind the book you have previous year question papers which you can refer to So here we have Pharmacology by Sinki Atiraj again one of my favorite books I don't have my copy because I gave it to my juniors and it never came back but this is a beautiful book for uh, pharmacology because it's already hard to study and this just simplifies it to a very good extent so highly recommend this book So this is again another book uh, which I do not have I don't have my copy but again this is a good book not the best I would highly suggest that you read Philips because the values have to be accurate for dental materials but otherwise this is a good book to have in hand Coming back to the cult favorite Jyotsna Rao here you can see that I've toned the book into subject wise because it becomes easier to carry it for anyone who wants something uh, like answer wise to refer to you can always have this book in hand but again please do study from standard Coming on to third year subjects we have again a companion here you can see how much i've referred to this companion how to use this i already have a video up on how to study for dental exams the link will be given please do check that video here again um it's the same as dento gist so you can see that i've marked the most important questions and how to like i've written down answers for like two markers or something which is important again we have jyotsna rao for third year as well uh it's the same as the first two years <laughs> so coming on to my cult favorite my biggest savior in fourth year that is this particular question bank i used only this question bank throughout my fourth year and there's a detailed description about how i used this in my previous video link will be given please please again i'm saying check it out because it's a very effective method to study and um Here you can see that I have uh, Jyotsna Rao split into different subjects because it came in two big volumes and the thing I would say that keep this book handy just in case you want to revise last minute or there is some in-depth explanations of some questions that you want you can always have this book in hand but again please do keep in mind that there are mistakes in this book here you can see that uh, the questions have been mentioned first and then the answers have been given so it is a good book to refer no that's it for this video guys i really hope that you guys liked it and it was helpful if it was then please please share this video with your friends i just i'm making these videos so that it helps you guys in some way or the other so please do share this video and subscribe to my channel and like the video because these are small things that keeps me motivated to create such content and if there's any request from your end if there's anything that you want me to talk about then please do leave those suggestions in the comment section below i would love to make those videos for you guys so that's it guys and my next video is going to be on online resources that i use during my years of dentistry which i thought would again be really helpful for a lot of people out there So make sure that you are subscribed stay tuned for all that until next time this is Divya signing off thank you so much for watching please stay at home please stay safe